I just realized I got some like weird rituals I do before I open up Magic the Gathering products. One of those things I smack myself in the face. I know, it's kind of weird. Anybody else do that? Is it just me? It might just be me. I'm not sure. This is a Mirage starter deck. Is that what they call it? Right? Starter deck? Wasn't it called a starter deck? Or tournament deck? Revised tournament deck. 60 tradable game cards and rule books. I have not opened one of these in well over, oh my God, uh, 25 years. <laughs> uh, I realized I did also have not purchased anything for myself to open on the channel other than like uh, stuff on eBay for like, you know, maybe some uh, goofy openings like uh, a repack series or maybe the stuff you see at Walmart or Target, you know, those cubes. Oh, look at that, man. Oh, I used to open these back in the day. I probably opened about four or five of these way back when. Um, this nice little pull tab. So I had to get myself something. I had to treat myself. And I treated myself to a Mirage starter deck to share with all you guys. Oh, my goodness. Um, we got an Eternal Masters box break. Or case, I'm not, not box break. Case break we're going to be doing. I should do it all in one video, which uh, is pretty freaking exciting. I believe... Aren't all the rares like right after this? I watched uh, another guy open these because it's been so long since I've done it. Uh, but I can't be certain. So I'm going to start from the bottom and start flipping. Ward of Lights. I feel like I need to stop right here and just see if that is a rare or not. <laughs> There's a Ward of Lights to show up. Let me double check really freaking quick. I'm not going to pause this or nothing, but I want to just double check. That doesn't make that doesn't seem right. Ward of Lights. That seems like that'd be a rare. Oh, that's a common. Okay. Okay, we're on a good path then. Okay. Okay. Whew. Sewer rats. Holy smokes, baby. Look at that. It looks like a little, little rat fellow with them circling with some things going on. Man, guys, I'm excited to be opening this. I hope you know. Also, oh my God, I didn't realize until a fan pointed it out. Thank you, fans, that really pay attention to the videos and detail of the cards. We opened a, uh, a misprint disenchant the other day, um, which is nuts. Yesterday's video in the Masters 25. It's crazy. There's a huge blue thing over one of the mana symbols. It's just nuts. Urborg Panther showing up. Ah, oh, the dream cache. Anyone got dream catchers? Like, I got dream catchers. <laughs> I used to have that was a lie. I used to have dream catchers. There's one in a storage box somewhere. I want to get a new dream catcher, though, and hang it over my, uh... Oh, that looks pretty. Oh, it's been so long. Destroy all global enchantments. They used to call them global and stuff. Isn't that nuts? I know. Destroy all global enchantments. But, um, I like dream catchers, you know? They catch all the nasty dreams. I don't really have bad dreams. Maybe, like, a bad dream, like, once every few months, maybe? Blistering barrier. That looks like a bad dream. Ah, okay. This costs, um, if you're going to be buying these on the market, they're almost $400 right now after tax and everything. So pretty freaking pricey, man. There's Giant Mantis. I'm going to go a little bit quicker here because these are all commons. And there's not much value in the common slot. Can I smell it? Oh, it smells so freaking old. I got to, I hold on, hold on. I got to smell that again. Oh, yeah, baby. That's the good stuff. Oh, that one smells like I remember in the card shop. 25 some years ago there's fetid horror oh yeah get that shade pumping and dumping baby get that shade pumping and dumping all shades should only be blocked by like black creatures you know there's jolt uh big news also the guy who taught me magic he's the one that has the music at the end of all these videos um in like the end screens you know when i give credits to all the patrons and whatnot and uh channel members he just dropped a new music video and if some of you are wondering, how come you only got like four different songs by him? Copyright issues. Uh, I think he's with Warner Records or something like that. He's got a big freaking contract going on right now, a big deal going on. Um, and they're looking to get, you know, more publicity and whatnot. But, oh, this card. Oh, my God. So iconic in my, in my world. Wow. Love is like a rhino, short-sighted and hasty. If it cannot find a way, it will make a way. That is breathtaking. Oh, I love the art on that. But he just wrapped a new music video, and I bet n I'm going to leave it at the end screen of this. But it's, his name is uh, or the, the uh, band name is Ghost Static. 
You can find him on YouTube also. But I got to give credit where credit's due, man. He is a very talented individual, and he does all the work on his music. He does have uh, you know other band members and whatnot, but he is uh, he's the freaking show, man. Uh, and also lead singer, very very talented individual. And if it wasn't for him, you wouldn't be seeing none of this right now. None of this would be happening. <laughs> Uh, but go check out his latest music video. It's Ghost Static, G H O S T A T I C. Um, and also, I'll plug it at the very end. Uh, at the end of this, I'll remind you again. But I am in the video. Can anybody tell me? I'm going to check the comments on the video. Can anyone tell me where I'm hiding in the video? I'm in the video. I, I definitely make a cameo, but you don't know it's me. I'm someone in the video. Which one? Who am I? Which one am I? <laughs> That's the question. Feral Shadow? Whew. Okay. That's all I got to say. More music coming, though. But, yeah, I told him, like, dude, you got to get me some stuff that's not copyrighted. He's like, all right. <laughs> sea Scryer. So, yeah, he has a lot of non-copyrighted. coming up with a lot of new tracks. Very, very good. Stalking Tiger? There you go. But so far, no one's been able to guess <laughs> who I am in there. They all get it wrong, so interesting. There's Merfolk Raiders. Phasing an Island Walk. I bet half of you watching right now couldn't tell me what phasing or island walk even is. Maybe? That's how old you that's how that's how young you are, I should say. That's, that's how old I am. Murfolk Graders. Armor of Thorns. You may choose to play Armor of Thorns. This guy, I never, this guy is creepy looking, man. He is freaking creepy looking. Play only on a non-black creature. Okay. Ooh, Builder's Bane. I thought that wasn't isn't that an uncommon? God, man, the artwork, that, that's like, when I first started, guys, this is what I was cracking open, man. That's what I was cracking open. I got to double-check the rarity here. I just don't want to make a mistake. That's all it is. Um, that's all it is. Bing, scoop. That's a common as well. Okay. So we're still on the common path. There's pacifism. Pretty freaking neat. Ooh, the cascade. Gain X plus three life. This better not be, we might be in uncommon territory. Uncommon territory? Possibly. There's some good uh, uncommons up in here, too, for damn sure. There's the old shaman. Pretty freaking cool. You know what they are? They're all tutors, baby. They're all freaking tutors. Blind Fury. All creatures lose trample until end of turn. Double all combat damage assigned to creatures this turn. That's interesting. All right, I'm going to check that out. We're going to look up another one just to make sure. I thought I got a good look at what the heck's what. That's uncommon. Okay, so I'm going to stop right there. These are going to be our, like our rares and stuff. are going to be right behind this pile. I'm just going to go quickly through the other stuff. There's a little Mirage book right freaking here. I would assume these are all lands without a freaking doubt. But there's, just to show you guys the artwork on these, pretty nice. Wow. I never liked that art right there. I don't know what it is. Never liked it. I got some new secret layers out now, man. The artwork on these, it's like, did you finish your, your painting? No? You didn't complete it? Nothing against some of the artists, but I, I don't know how Wizards let some of this stuff out, you know. it's uh, It just looks like it's not complete. You know? <laughs> not complete. All right. We are to the... Oh, boy. Okay. So that most likely is going to be a rare, I would assume. Uncommons are over here then. Okay. How many we got here? Oh, I don't even know. Like, no, there's three. One, two. Okay, we're going to put that back down. Oh, gosh. Okay. Barbed foliage. There you go. Whenever a creature attacks you, it loses flanking. Oh, flanking. That never took off. And we got the old wyvern. Oh, yeah. Flying protection from green. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, man. <sighs> Tudor. Marble diamond. Marble freaking diamond. Very cool. Very cool. Come on, baby. The Briss Jin. Okay. It's not a rare, is it? Three, four. Sometimes Jins uh, have, have been a, like rares a lot. Let me just double check again. Infernal Contract. I just want to get ahead of myself, guys. Infernal Contract is the rare. Okay. We know that much. So the rares are going to be right here. So let's get through to the rest of this pile. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, Cavrick's Hex. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Okay. 
Oh, sand golem. Okay. Now we go into the rares. Oh, man. Didn't pull nothing crazy. Where's my tutors at, guys? Come on, wizards. Should have stacked those for me, baby. All right. So our first rare is going to be Infernal Contract. Come on, baby. Come on. Do the chant with me, guys. We need something real freaking nasty. We need something nasty. This guy's looking like, oh, my God. That's, that's the guy my wife thinks is hot. She's like, yeah, dude. Okay, come on, baby. Come on. Give me a Phyrexian Dreadnought. I'll settle for Phyrexian Dreadnought. We'll be cool with that. Oh, oh, oh. It, it's a freaking card. Yes. It's an artifact. You know what that means? Oh, my God. It's an artifact, guys. Razor Pendulum. Oh, you freaking tease. That art's sick, though. At the end of each player's turn, if that player has five or less life, Razor Pendulum deals two damage to him or her. It's like, it's a matter of time, pal, before you go and die. <laughs> All right, last card. Oh, Spectral Guardian. Well, we got a nice swift kick right in the pants. Uh, thank you, everyone, who tuned into this one, though. Well, I was hoping for a bit better. Um, we really did not pull anything of value. I definitely got taken to Pound Town riding on the F truck. But you know what? That's okay. Life goes on. Life goes on. Check out Ghost Addict's new music, though, and then new music video. Let me know who you think I am. I'll leave it right after these credits. Skaboosh. Uh...